All right, guys. Would you look at who's in the banner? Itadori Yuji. And, well, we got to get him. So we're at 19K. We started with like 43,000. It's like almost double pity. It's, it's not been looking good for us. But we have 69 tickets to go through to attempt to get him. So, uh, this is going to take a while. So, apparently, or so I've, I've heard is uh, Yuji does not have an evolution yet. That is coming with the weekend update. So, if that is true, then sadly, there will be no Yuji uh, Evo showcase tonight. But there will be a unique Megumi and Gojo. So... Alright, this is gonna take a while, so let's see what we got here. Gara. <clears throat> Gara again. Oh boy, this is gonna take a long time. Sanji. Speaking of Sanji, last uh, last video. I just got a double passive, what the heck? <laughs> um last video I pulled a divine Sanji. I thought it was Reaper, but it was actually a divine. Just a lot of Garas. Toad wanted me to use all of the tickets, but nah, that's going to take way too long to do. I'll do like five more. So one, two, three. What would be crazy this update is like if we pull Lelouch, that'll be crazy. for the big guns. I'm hoping we can get super lucky and pull Yuji really fast. We do know Nanami is one of the units, but I'm wondering if he is going to be the exclusive unit or is he going to be the, uh, is he going to be summonable? Oh yeah. Oh, Yuji might be the exclusive unit who evolves into Skuna, that would make so much sense. Okay, <laughs> that Goku scared me. Alrighty, this is taking a while, so we're going to skip to when we get him. So I am pulling divine traits like crazy, or whatever rarity you want to call that, and still no mythic. This is absurd. There he is. Itadori Yuji. It took three pities to get him. That is absurd, guys. That is just absolutely absurd. But in any case, Itadori Yuji right here. Mythic. So 143 damage, 7.1 SBA with 15 range. This is my level one. Now, we have no candies or anything, so this is going to be him uh, showcasing him at level 1. So before anything, let's see what our precious, precious Yuji evolves into. So, Sukun. I see. So he literally has no Evo currently, so that is true. So, we will do some passive uh, rerolls on him and maybe get Divine or something. You know, wink, wink game. So we're at 38. Let's get that down to 18. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. It's crazy. Let's do two more. Superior 3. We'll keep that on. All righty. So Itadori is sadly not 
a limited unit. So let's lock him. He's not limited, but he is cool. And in the end, that's what matters. Alrighty, I will see you guys when I can showcase him properly. Alright guys, so let me place okay, let me place start back here just in case. Alright. So let's see you I forgot to bring him. I'll be right back. Okay, so, <clears throat> you know, to make up for what just happened. Um, so, we have Yuji now. We have the money. And we are quickly going to sell you and put you back here. Now we're going to place a Yuji. So, he's only level one. Don't roast him. So, let's see. Okay. Oh, dude, these effects are top notch. What? Let me see that again. Okay. So he two pieces them. That's nice. So 302 Divergent Slam is the next ability. Okay, so it's literally slam. I really like the effects. It looks like straight out the anime. That's actually nice. Okay. 660. Okay. Divert oh black flash. Oh my. That looks pretty cool. And the thing is, he definitely turns into uh, Skuna, which I don't understand why they wouldn't make him the... Uh... Oh, you know what I think? Is that I think what you do to Nanami is that they'll make you grind the uh, whatever, like uh, grind infinite and stuff and get the fingers. And you probably need like 20 of them or something because that's how many you need. And then you can um, Evo him or something like that. That'll be pretty cool. But anyway... Let me talk. He's actually pretty expensive for him being just, uh, just non-Evo. This is 2.2k every five and a half seconds. I, now, I don't know much. Oh, he also has Superior 3. But even then, I don't know much about, like, how to look at level 1 stats. But I'd say that's pretty good for a level one non-evoed unit. That looks pretty, pretty solid, especially with this big of a, uh, of a AOE. Definitely, this will be really good for new players, even though he can't evo yet. This is actually pretty good. Or I may be tweaking and this is just not it <laughs> at all. Um, but either way, um, Hope you like his attacks. He does look nice. Uh, sorry, it's kind of scuffed. Um, Toad comes back work from the work is like uh, blah blah blah. I can't even speak English in a in a while. But I will continue to do these quick little showcases so you can see what the units look like and see if we should go for them or not. Sadly, I don't have the uh, the fruits and stuff to really show off. You know, like Yuji's true potential, but at the same time. He's not going to Evo until the weekend. So either way, thanks for watching. Leave some hearts in the comments for Toad. And I'll see you guys later. Reese's Pieces. Bye.